For the aptly scratched test, the subject may sit or stand with the examiner standing next to the subject. The test has three different positions and they all test various things. First position, the subject will take one hand and touch the opposite shoulder. And they will repeat the same test on the other side. Asymmetrical results is indicative of glenohumeral adduction, internal rotation, and horizontal flexion. It's all limited. Limits in scapular protraction may also produce asymmetrical results. For the second position, the subject will turn around and place one arm over their head and reach behind the back as if they're scratching the middle of their upper back. They repeat the test on the other side. Asymmetrical results in this test is indicative of limited glenohumeral abduction and in external rotation and scapular upward rotation and elevation. For position number three, the subject still facing the other way will place their hand in the small of their back and reach upward as far as possible. Asymmetrical results are positive of limited glenohumeral adduction, internal rotation, and scapular retraction and downward rotation.